Hi everyone, what's up? It's Joshua here from Alternative Brewing. And today we're brewing coffee with the Baletti Mocha Pot Express. The Baletti Express is an all aluminium stovetop espresso maker, or you may refer to it as a stovetop percolator. It's the ideal coffee brewer to make good strong coffee that's convenient and more forgiving than espresso brewing. They're compatible with gas and electric stovetops and work really well with camp style cookers too. They come in a various of sizes from one cup all the way up to 18 cups. Today, I'm brewing with the most common six cup model. So let's get brewing using the Baletti Mocha Pot Express. What I'll do first is weigh out and grind my beans. I'm using the Well Home Grinder and what I'll usually do to get the right amount of coffee is simply use the filter basket of the Baletti to achieve the right amount of beans. You'll never get it wrong this way, but in weighing your coffee out, the basket holds approximately 40 grams. Now you wanna grind your coffee to a fine grind, nothing too coarse, but not as fine as espresso either. Place the grounds in the basket and I'll flatten down the grinds gently with the back of a spoon for a smooth surface. Next, I'll fill up my heating vessel with water to just below that little pressure valve inside, which is 300 milliliters of water. And it's best to use heated water to fill your vessel as this will speed up the whole brew time and make your coffee less bitter. Place the filter basket on top, ensuring that the surface around the rim is now free of any grinds, as we wanna make sure there is a nice seal when we screw down the coffee collector on top of the heating vessel. Place your Baletti on the stove on a medium heat. So I'm aiming for a heat that lets the pressure gradually rise, and then the water will slowly percolate up through the bed of coffee. Otherwise, it will produce a bitter coffee. It will start off slow and then speed up at the end, and you'll see it's done when the water does begin spurting out the top. It should take a total of five minutes or so to complete a full brew. And you don't wanna leave it there on the stove until there's some steam. So turn off your heat and pour your coffee directly into your cups. Now I enjoy my coffee black, but they are the perfect strength to add some milk for a delicious flat white. In cleaning the unit, you wanna make sure that it's all cooled down and you can rinse it under some cold water to speed this process up. But once it's cool, unscrew the top, tap out the grinds. And so long as everything is cold, I find blowing on the end of the funnel gets the grinds out really easily. Rinse everything underwater, and now it's really important to make sure everything is thoroughly dry if you wanna avoid any oxidization of the aluminium and clean out that burnt coffee. Also storing the top and the bottom apart prolong the life of the seal. And that's the Baletti Mocha Pot Express for you. It's a really durable coffee maker that makes a strong coffee you can enjoy on your own, but always better with a friend. Any questions on the Baletti Mocha Pot Express, throw them in the comments below. We'll get straight back to you. If you've enjoyed this video and found it helpful, hit a like, subscribe to keep notified when we bring out videos just like this every week. We'll see you next time.